When you are a foreigner frozen chicken brand and the country you sell in decides to impose massive regulations on chicken imports, you know you're having a bad day. Local chicken products were suddenly giving Saudis much cheaper alternatives to global brands. We faced going out of business in a few years. We knew we couldn't fight back a government decision, so we went straight to someone who might just listen, our customers, the Saudi women of today. These very women were now empowered by the new Saudi laws to shift their focus to finding achievement and pleasure outside the kitchen and beyond cooking. And because of that, their demand for further processed products, FPPs, started to grow. Sadia, the market leader in the whole poultry segment for its outstanding quality, suddenly became a leader in the wrong category. The going out of business one. We had to shift our business focus and objectives to FPPs ASAP. So we let the local brands fight their price-driven strategy and decided to make food, not war. Our strategy was simple. We used the mom's most influential source of information, and we educated her on the fact that our FPP range is made from the same chicken she has trusted and loved throughout the years. The campaign hit home emotionally. The rational price saving was blown to pieces. Sales skyrocketed, and our market share not only increased, but doubled for some of the products like the breaded burger. And our value share went up to way above where we were before the government intervention. This prompted us to understand that customers may be price sensitive, but a mom would always choose the best quality for her loved ones. It's so simple. It made us wonder why no one else thought about it.